Hey guys, this is the stupid bullying independent journey of an independent filmmaker trying to get back on the horse. My fourth feature length film. I did a two camera shoot today and then I cleaned up some room on my computer for editing. See ya. An independent filmmaker bullying himself into working harder because it's worth it. It's worth it to work hard, right? I don't like this anymore. I went from questionable to liking it to not liking it. So it's definitely a question mark right now. Today, after work, I had a shoot, two camera shoot, just me, and it was weird. I have never done that. I made my first video in 1997. I made my first film in 1999. And today, with my character, two cameras, two tripods, setting it up making like a dummy and because uh, i was like going on a third story setting my focus turning it on and running <laughs> taking off my other oh, right here taking off my glasses putting on my jeffrey Dahmer glasses uh getting as fat as i could get get my mullets out ball fat bald mullet child molester looking out the window, watching kids. It was creepy. It was really creepy. And we were going to shoot it Sunday. Uh, I talked to Serenity again, and I said, hey, we got those two shots, the voiceover, and I need I need a couple pickup shots of me. And I thought about it all day. I said, man, I do not want Serenity to even look at me like this. It's going to be bad enough when she watches the final film. Ugh. Anyways, I said, you know what? It might take a bunch of extra work, but I could probably do that myself. And it was a good day one for my character, too, because I'm still working out some kinks. Um, uh, on one of the shoots was driving, and I had a short sleeve shirt on. I'm like, dude, I can't have tattoos. So I learned some things. Anyways, shoot. And then I came home, and I sat down, and I was in a I was in a Bam Margera mood, and so I watched Ming Hags, factory sealed. I've owned it for so long. Free poster and stickers. I've never even opened it till today. Watched Ming Hags, watched it again with the commentary. I love Joe Franz. Um, I'm watching all the special features right now, and while I was sitting there doing it, I got some fucking work done. Holy shit. Got the external drive. Man, I worked for an entire movie going through my, my Apple photos, taking every video, copying it to a folder, and then putting it on the external. Probably like close to two hours to do that. And it freed up 50.95 gigs. That's crazy. All that work for 50 gigs. So I found a bunch of shit that uh, was for different YouTube projects. Like, I'm not going to work on any of that for a while. Like, is this yours? Casual Fridays are done. Is this yours? Uh, we were doing the medium dive. All these projects that I just have on hold, man. I, in my life right now, YouTube is like, we're still going to do G-rated porn and me just playing kind of in the realm of my movie. Um, but if it doesn't involve my movie or it cleaned up, or no, I don't give a shit about it. So all that stuff is just moved. Leaving me with, I almost tripled it. Uh, we got, this is so laughable too. 143.96 gigs. So that's basically 144 gigs. We got 144 gigs free. <laughs> but I've got all those projects that are like 50 to 90% done. So once I finish those and get them on out of here, I should have did that today. I thought all day, I was like, I'm going to go edit. I'm going to go edit. I'm going to go edit. And then I went and did my shoot. And while I was shooting, I was thinking, I have to make space. I have to make space. I have to make space. Which is, uh, I made a responsible decision. I've got to do this shit in order, man. We're making a feature length film. I need room. So I freed up a bunch of room. A bunch of room. Let's see. Two cam shoot. You know what I should have said? I said, hey, guys, this is the stupid bullying independent journey of an independent filmmaker trying to get back on the horse. 
my fourth feature length film. Uh, I did a two camera shoot today and then I cleaned up some room on my computer for editing. See ya. That's what I should have said. Maybe I'll just take that one sentence and just put it. 237 videos. To get that 50.95 gigs, the one that took me the longest, the hand picking each video, 237 videos. It takes a long time to, to drag and drop those. All the videos in a flash. I'm not a tech person, so I don't understand this. The videos from the new iPhone shot in cinematic mode took fucking forever. Like a real professional camera. It must be something in the processing and the way they're stored. And if I'm going to move them, they have to like up res them or something. Because I mean, I've got professional footage on there. I got the, we paid for, we had a drone operator come to Flagstaff. All that stuff, bam, transferred in the blink of an eye. Big files too. But grabbing a cinematic file from an iPhone, video shot in cinematic mode, snail's face. All right, so now I got to do a bunch of editing and prep Sunday shoot. Um, oh, and I went and bought a bunch of cheap ass AA batteries. Because I need to go try to capture the VHS footage that we shot last weekend. Still haven't seen it yet. But um, I got to pick my battles. I got to pick my battles. This is dumb.